Okay, so back into simulation mode we we go. Because it's time to uh, get more get more licenses. By more licenses I mean another license, so finished all the B class stuff, it's time for our A class license. Oh boy! So thank you, Keenan, very cool. So we have ten more tests to do. And uh, let's just get started. Our first A class test. Been all gold. Well, of course I am, Steve. So, uh, here we are, starting at A1, high speed braking. So, you'll start braking while going much faster than in the B license test. Remember, faster speed means a longer braking distance. Eh, use the distance marker. Distance markers to learn where to start braking. Okay. This is basically start-stop four, except we're starting at a very high speed, uh, 124 miles per hour to be exact, in a R32 v GTR V-Spec, oh my god, big quick. Let's go. Oh, it was. There we are. Zoom! We are zooming. Rolling start! Don't need to worry about upshifting. I don't know when to break, so I'm just gonna break there. One line before 900 meters, that's way too late. Okay, decent start. Two tenths off of gold. Beat the uh, bronze time by seven tenths. Not a bad start. I'll take that. And now we go for gold. The. Er, th Just item speed. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Fucking beautiful. Did it. Hell yeah. Sweet. Alright. One down, nine to go. So. That was high-speed braking. Now time for cornering and braking. So instead of simply braking, you must brake while turning. Note how the car moves outward when you apply the brakes and inward when you release them. Apply and release the brakes gently and quickly to control braking while rounding a curve. Yeah, about that gentle thing, I'm, I'm using the square button so I can't really do that. But anyways, we're going to be driving a Subaru Legacy this time, starting at 93 miles per hour. A rolling start! So let's go. So, uh, time to go to fake test course. This isn't the real test course, this is a lie. This is basically just the same distance, but there's a curve involved. Oh god. I kinda didn't do that well, because I didn't know where to break. Yeah, this test is literally the swerve strat, except you're forced to do it. <laughs> Although the car understeered more than I was expecting there. I couldn't tell you which, uh... Which game has the hardest tests? Like, overall. There! <laughs> so, uh, I've already forgotten the name of the person, I'm sorry, but so so to the person in chat who said uh, he finally got this by... I did it. Did the exact same thing. Fucking point zero zero one, baby. Let's fucking go. <laughs> that was beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Alright. Fuck yeah, bud. So. <laughs> that was done. Let's move on to I or A3 now. So. We're done with the braking tests. Let's go to Intermediate Cornering 1. FF car. This is a cornering test using a FF. Front wheel drive. Car. Follow the line. Called a record line. That shows the ideal path in the course. Apply solid braking when entering the corner to lower your speed. 
and uh, we're going to be driving an Integra Type R at 93 miles per hour on the start. Rolling start. Let's go. Twenty-one point six to pass, nineteen point two for gold. Oh, it's this turn. Okay, I remember this turn for the B license. All right, five tenths or three tenths off of gold first run. Not bad. Not gold, obviously, but not bad. Now let's go for gold. Just try better. I'm trying. Trying to do more gooder. Just playing an automatic, dude. I know, right? Imagine me from like ten years ago. I mean, what? There we go. <laughs> I did it again. <laughs> Two in a row. Fucking point zero zero. <laughs> God damn it. Wow. Two straight golds that I got it by point zero zero one. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Okie dokie. So fucking hell. <laughs> the streak continues. Alright, so. Next up, that one kicked my ass, by the way. Next up, Intermediate Cornering 2, an FR car. So this is a cornering test using an FR. Rear wheel drive car. Know how differently the car handles compared to the FF car. The response to fishtailing also differs from FF cars. <gasps> you practice with both kinds of cars to get used to these differences. Okie dokie, daddy. They're gonna be driving a uh, Alteza for this test. Ooh. One blows. Or maybe it's you that blows, Keenan. <laughs> I mean, what? Anyways, 19.3. Oh, fuck me for this one. Okay, well, not a good first attempt, but <laughs> there we are. That's not even going to be good enough for bronze. Or silver, I mean. But I, I love how, like, the bronze time is always way behind silver compared to gold to silver. Alright, well, let's go for gold. Like, that line was, like, right on. It's just, I carried just a little too little speed. Okay, that works. <laughs> I don't know how that worked, but it worked. Fucking hell. Alright, that took forever. Jesus. Whew, that was a tough one. <laughs> Fucking hell. Also, the point zero zero one streak is over. <laughs> let, let me just show you these times. Good God. Alright, so... That's done. Now it's time for Intermediate Quartering 3, FF car. So, back into the Integra. Now we gotta practice cornering with L-shaped turns. Even though it's an L-shaped turn, smoothly follow a circular line. Practice accurately tracing a line through the apex, the point at which the car is closest to the inside of the corner. Alright, let's take some L's on our Integra. Let's fucking go. This Type R is now a Type L. So basically, this is just kind of a sharp turn. Uh, not like that, by the way. That don't don't no, <laughs> don't do that. That's potentially faster than Jim Jago. Boom, bibbity, bye, bye. Yes. All right. I actually have to slow down for the turn. It's a quick flick. And that was semi quick. Twelve seven one three. Two seconds above the the bronze. Now let's hopefully get the gold. Also, yeah, we don't have a piss line this time. 
The only piss is me. Okay, well that was easy. Easy enough. I guess that makes up for uh, struggling at A4 so much. We got the piss medal, or trophy. Ta-da! <laughs> easy peasy, nothing to it. Now we get to do it again in the Alteza. So now, practice cornering with L-shaped turns. Feel the difference on how FF and FR cars move. Pay attention to when you release the brakes, when you change the car's direction without using brakes, nor acceleration, and when you start accelerating. Okie dokie. So we have to go one-tenth faster for gold, but two-tenths slower for bronze in the Alteza. <laughs> Not again. Missed by .002 in PAL. Well, shit. Oh well. That's good that I'm playing the filthy American version, and that was terrible. Don't do that. Alright, well that was... <laughs> that was a joke of a run. Fucking hell. Let's, uh, let's do betterer. Woo. Ooh, that felt adequate. And it was adequate. Alright, cool. Got it. Got the gold. Ta-da! Only took a few tries. That was, uh... At least not nearly as terrible as A4, so there's that. Woo! Alright. So the intermediate cornering is done. It's time for some applied cornering now. The S turn. So, practice attacking corners in a high powered four wheel drive machine. Four wheel drive cars, known for high stability but poor turning performance, have many pe peculiarities. There we go, that's the word. To watch out for including record line tracing, timing of accelerator use, and fine steering adjustments. Okie dokie. So just do the S-turn, idiot, in a normal drive car, basically. Ooh, we're driving the 3000 GT. Turbo MR. Yeah. Let's, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Ray tracing pog. Let's freaking go. It's more like piss tracing, but yeah. Oh, I remember this S turn, okay. Okay, I sort of remember it. This feels like the S at high speed ring, except a bit tighter. So, uh... So, uh... So... So that happened. Pog Champ. First try, baby. Alright, now we get to do it in a real drive car, specifically a Super RZ. Oh boy. I just realized first try gold on A7. Again. Except it wasn't nearly as easy this time than GT1. Hardest test. Fucking impossible. Alright, so, practice attacking corners in a high-powered FR machine. With FR cars, the timing of the accelerated use greatly affects the car's movement. Use fine steering adjustments to neatly trace the record line. Your exit speed in the last corner is very important. Yes, it is. So, we have to go six-tenths faster in the Supra than we did in the uh, 3000 GT for gold. So that, let's, uh, let's see how much I, oh, piss card, following the piss line, let's go. The Supra. 13.5 at the sector split. Let's go, piss, 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 piss! Yeah! <laughs> Fuck your S pins, I'm God. I am the Lord of the S. I have won the piss challenge. I am the piss lord. Let's fucking go. Two in a row, baby. Two in a row.
Fuck yeah. What's poppin'? Alright, so that's that. Now for Applied Cornering 3, the sharp turn. So, uh, back into the 3000 GT. This cornering test uses a combination of right angle corners. Smoothly follow the cornering line. Make sure you cross the apex. And always be sure to give full throttle when exiting the last corner. Okie dokie. 17.7 for bronze, 14.1 for gold. Let's fucking go. Okay, all you need is piss to pass. So yeah, this was the, uh, yeah, sharp S, alright. Well, no three golds in a row, sadly, but we got a silver. And we got four tenths to gain, so... Way to go! We, we've uh, we've passed over a, an hour work, uh, working on this license, by the way. Is anyone keeping score at home? That was pretty spicy. Oh, that was spicy. Yeah, there we go. Fuck yeah. Beat it by over a tenth. Sweet. That just leaves one more test, and it's the sharp turn, but in the Supra, so this involves a combination of right-angle corners. The key is to stop braking and start using your steering at the turn entry point to control the car's position. Then give full throttle when exiting the last corner. Gotcha. So, we have to go four tenths faster for gold, seven tenths faster for bronze. So, uh, here we go. Time for our final A license test and immediate upshift. All right, cool. Oh, this thing has better brakes as well. Okay. Well, uh, that didn't happen. But let's try. Let's get a good first try out. Uh, I said a good first try. That was oh my god. All right, just get across the line. Stupid. Fuck. There you go. There's your fucking shakedown run. God damn it. No. We got our A license. Yay. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, well, we got the actual license acquired, so that's cool. Now let's go for the car. Mm -hmm. I have an idea. I might try in this attempt. Okay, the idea was shifting in the third, but also, holy fuck, those lines. Well, there we go. Oh. All you have to do is just fucking use every last millimeter that you're allowed to use before you get failed. Jesus Christ. Alright. Bing bong bao. Now we got our new car with our new license. <laughs> Alrighty then. I mean, I pretty much did not leave any room on the table there and beat the gold by, like, over a tenth. What was it? Yeah, by, like, almost two tenths, so. Here's my records from all the tests. God, A4. <laughs> then that happened. And then the two golds in a row, two first tries in a row, <laughs> Woo. And there you have it. That's the A license done. Uh, only for gold, Matt. You only get cars for gold. So, there it is. There's our A license tests, all with the gold trophies. So, let's check out our new car. What did we get? We got, oh, we got a copperhead. Hello, beautiful. Nice to see you again. Wait, this is mid-engine? What? Interesting. Yeah. 
We got another copperhead. Will I use it in this LP? Well, um, maybe. Front engine, and yet it's MR in the game. Someone fucked up. Unless it's front, uh, front mid engine. Which it very well could be. Great GT2 botches. Yeah. Yeah. But anyways, there's that. So, uh, we got 20 more gold trophies and our A license. So now we can go participate in, uh, all the racing series that have an A license max. Which, we'll, we'll do that next.